We've all been to different fundraising conferences where we've all listened to three or four different fundraising speakers, usually with hundreds of people in the audience. That's great, but it dawned on me that there are many fundraisers there who've got plenty of expertise and experience that we never get to hear about. We only get to hear about them in the coffee breaks for five, ten minutes. I thought, why not turn it around and have the audience as the speakers at an event? And after that idea came Fundraising Camp. Fundraising Camp is unlike all other conferences where you sit quietly, politely, in an audience, listening to the great and the good at the front with all their expertise, which is useful, but this turns it round. It's you, the audience, you are the experts, you're the ones with experience. So we've got 60 people here today, all of them sharing ideas, experiences, good experiences and bad experiences, and lessons that they've learned in their fundraising. Very so shortly, I'll be asking you to come up and stick some ideas on some notes, um, post-it notes, and we'll come up with what we're going to talk about today. At the moment, we don't know. I'm just hopeless at big conferences. If I'm in a big conference, I will go and have lunch, and I'll sit in a corner, and I need somebody to come up and talk to me. Uh, here, you just find yourself somehow being infected by the idea of just kind of bubbling around and talking to people. It's quite unknown. So when I arrived, I didn't know what to expect at all. Um, and I was a bit daunted by the prospect of presenting on something, but it hasn't really been like that. It has been more collaborative and people just having a discussion and threshing things out. It's, you know, really organic conversation and, and people just kind of bounce off each other. So it's, it kind of can be about one topic, um, but if it's not that relevant for you, then the topics kind of quickly change and it kind of um, keeps you, you know, keeps you on your toes. We're discussing things that are really relevant to us. We're asking honest questions, sharing experiences, um, learnings, challenges, frustrations, things we're excited about. There's just lots going on and then each room is very different to the last. People seem to be very open about sharing their stories and experiences, talking about real examples of what they've done. I haven't noticed anybody keeping anything back. Well, I think the nice thing about the charity sector um, is that everyone's working towards the same thing and so you can share things and it's not the same as being in the corporate sector and it's really nice to come together um, and means that we go away and, and we can raise more money for our particular causes um, without detracting from anyone else so everyone's very happy to share. I'm quite new to fundraising so for me it's invaluable to um, speak to people at all different levels of their career so you've got really experienced people who you can learn from and then you've got um, people who are kind of at the same stage as me kind of trying to find their way a little bit. In a sense the big conferences are just too big I mean so if you ever come here it's really kind of fun because you can actually just sit down have some fun there's lots of smiling and laughing going along um, and actually pick up some of the stuff that's just interesting. Today was the first one in Oxford I chose Oxford because that's where my fundraising career started as a volunteer student and then as my first paid fundraising job but we do plan to take it around the country to many different towns and cities particularly the smaller ones that don't get their own fundraising conferences or events so if you've got an idea for a session or or for a town that you'd like to see a fundraising camp, do get in touch with us. Fundraising Camp is coming to you soon. <laughs>